Hey guys, so today I'm going to be doing my hair in this video and I am going to be using a tool that's new to me. It's the Revlon Salon Long Lasting Waves Deep Waver. Looks like this here. It's pink. It's really cute. So this has an on off switch right here and it goes all the way up to 30. It starts at level one for fine hair. So I guess you can use this on any kind of hair. You just adjust um, the amount of heat. And we're gonna see how this works. I don't know why it seems like it's not gonna be easy, but we're gonna find out. So it just says that you're just gonna take sections of your hair and I don't know, do you, I don't know. I don't know if I'm supposed to just clamp down, but it's super hot. I will definitely say that. And I guess you just go all the way to the end and <laughs> it looks like, literally feel like I'm back in high school with these waves. But that was very easy. It wasn't hard at all and it definitely didn't take long. You hold it a very small amount of time. Just clamp it down your hair just let it sit there for a couple seconds I mean unless your hair is you know really fine or you don't want to leave it on that long or something that's fine and um, you just go all the way down to the ends I mean from what I can tell that's all I'm supposed to be doing right if you guys have used this let me know I just I don't know I'm in a funk with my hair and I feel like I either we're in a ponytail or I am you know, curling it like I normally do with just my one inch curling iron, which is fine. I mean, I don't have a problem with this. It. Just sometimes you get, sometimes you get restless and you just want to do something different. And it's kind of where I'm at right now. Get extremely, extremely hot. So definitely be mindful of that if you have, especially like pets or kids or. Okay, so I think that looks pretty good. I. Let's see. So I'm also going to take a section, a smaller section from up here and go down because it says that you're really supposed to start closer to the roots. And I guess I didn't really do that with this, but um, it's okay though because I'm just trying it out today to see if I actually like it and wanted to keep it. And so far I think it's cute. I think it's going to give me the little bit extra that I was looking for for my hair, I hope. So I'm just going literally just up and down my hand shaking because I'm trying to squeeze it pretty hard Whew. okay when I do this again I will definitely use like a heat protectant spray because this is definitely definitely hot and I haven't been blow drying my hair lately because like I said I I haven't really had to go anywhere for many many months now um, I got laid off my job in March because of the virus and I did not get called back. Um, there were about 30 of us on the same day. I just worked for like a small, um, a small business here where I live and we did anesthesia um, billing and customer service for um, anesthesiologist and about 30 of us got let go all on the same day. It was probably the worst day I've ever had at work. Um, I had been there for a couple years and I really, really liked it. I liked everybody that I worked with. I liked the job, but, but since that has happened, I have not been getting up and blow drying my hair or um, anything much because I haven't really had anywhere to go. All right, the so off-on switch is here. So I'm just going to turn it off. And it also has a locking feature right here on the back. If you close it together, um, it says unlock and lock. And if you slide it up to lock, it locks it together. And it says that that's the best way to cool it off. That way it's not laying out. So it's off, the red light went off. I've got it clamped together and I'm just putting it down on a safe surface. And let's see, let's see how this looks. I think it's pretty cute. Um, I would definitely, I think next time, do it in two layers. Um, so do like the bottom layer and then come back and do it around the top layer. But yeah, it's cute. It's like crimped or it's like I braided my hair. Like my mom used to braid my hair when I was in high school. Used to wash my hair at night and she would braid it while it was wet. 
so that when I woke up in the morning it kind of looked like this. So I'm just going to take my brush and kind of just very gently, just very gently go around the ends so they're not too straggly. But yeah, I think it's cute. Um, I mean, I would, I'm going to definitely try some more stuff with it and all that. I just wanted to see what my first impression was going to be. Only mid to late 90s high school, but in a good way. So, let's see, what can I do? I'm just going to take this little piece and just do a little tiny pin back. Just see how that looks. So, I've just got, so I've just got a little clip here. And, one, two, I don't know if I can get it in there. All right. Okay. So, yeah, I think that's pretty cute. Something new and something different, and I really think it's cute. So the makeup that I'm wearing in today's video, I actually just filmed a get ready with me with mostly new products. So that video is up if you have any questions about anything that I have on as far as makeup goes. And thank you so much for watching this video. I really, really appreciate it, and I hope you guys have a really great day, and I'll see you next time. Bye.